Just then you really got it going after that. And you're up by 20 in the first half. Just talk about how well you guys played in that first half. What was, what was working for you so well? You can. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I don't want to say. We just stayed at it. I mean, stayed aggressive, attacking around. Uh, eventually, it started falling. Uh, uh, Coach, Coach said, uh, just get something to get you going. Either a layup, either an assist, get a rebound, kick out. So uh, I think we, we did that instead of staying, and that just got us going after that. Well, Sean, how comfortable are you right now? <coughs> like a whole different player from last year. Just talk about where you're at mentally, physically, everything. Uh, you know, the whole, the whole deal with me last year was my foot was still bothering me a whole lot than what I was saying. But uh, it's fixed now, and I enjoy my coach, the guy I'm playing for, my team. I mean, they just they make it comfortable, comfortable for me. You know, they put me in a leader position, and I try my best to uphold it. You guys only had, I think, 11 turnovers, and four of those came real late. You really cleaned up the turnovers. Talk, talk about that. Yeah. Uh, coach came hard on us in practice about it. He told us about it every day we watched film on uh, He even cut the film off because he was so mad. So we, that, that made us uh, made it come out and just want to not, not get no turnover. But you talk about the spacing on offense tonight. I mean, from game one to game two, you guys have opened the passing lanes. It looked like you were very unselfish and, and it just flowed a lot better than half court. Oh, yeah, that's what we've been working on in practice. So practice makes it better in the game, so it's just easy. So we got this cut game, we just cutting, screen pass, moving, we just we just gotta keep doing that and keep it savage that we'll be better. Oakland's supposed to be a, a challenge and a good team, a dangerous team. Uh, how much confidence do you get after a night like this when you play so well against them? I mean, we get a lot of confidence. I mean, they're still a good basketball team no matter how much we beat them by. Uh, they have a very good guard at the point guard position. I mean, like they're very well coached. We just came out to play and they caught us on the night where everything was falling. Does it mean anything extra to you guys if they just lost that Alabama and you beat them worse than Alabama did? I mean, does that mean anything to you? Because you're obviously going to be playing Alabama. No, I, don't, I don't think that, that don't mean nothing to us. For, we just take it as another game now and we get prepared for our next one. How about the first half guys seem like a real sense of urgency to kind of take Oakland's energy out of, out of the equation right away? Oh, yeah, we got, we got um, 23 in foul trouble. I think that's a good team because he is ahead. So we, Coach said cut the head off. As he, he had a little body, he said he was the head, so we got to cut the head off. That's what we did, so that's why we got that big lead. Ricky, you were hobbled last year with, with, with an injury. Just, just how fresh do you feel, and, and, and how do you feel you played this first couple of years? Uh, I feel blessed just just come out here and just be as energetic as I can be and just help my team. Uh, I was down when Sean kept picking me up <coughs> in the first half. I don't think I played good. I still don't think I played a well game, but I'm just glad when Sean, my teammate, kept picking me up. So I just thank God for that. Did you guys at any point look at the scoreboard in the first half and think, wow, we're beating this team by 28? Oh, yeah. These guys are pretty good. They went to the NCAA tournament the last year. I mean, what, and then if you did, kind of what was going through your mind? I mean, I try not to look at the scoreboard for uh, Just to keep playing and just to get a W at the end of the day. And we, we did. Ricky, what, what would be your thoughts on this? I did look at the scoreboard, and it's hard for me not to. I just, I just want to get a blowout every every game. That's just me. I look at the scoreboard, and I think when we came out in the second half, I think we were still looking at the scoreboard. So that's why they came. Yeah, they, I heard they scored 17 points in like four minutes, and that's why I think we should not look at the scoreboard. We should just keep playing, like Marshawn said. Ricky, you had 10 points, four boards, five assists, no turnovers. That's a bad night for you. <laughs> I, <laughs> it doesn't sound bad, but I don't, I'm just me. I just like getting my team involved, and then I was just missing layups that I know I should have made, and it just, it's just me. I'm just think that's just me. I, I've come down hard on myself. I shouldn't, but I just do. You know, with all the newness, you know, new coaching staff, some new players, everybody learning new systems. Are you surprised you guys could play this this crisply so so early in the year? I mean, I'm gonna say we're like where we want to be, but. Uh, as of right now, I feel like we work so hard in practice. Uh, if we just carry our practices over to our games, then it should work out. You guys are playing a little rock Friday. I heard something have a real good recent history down there. Um, sorry, no, I don't want to pick off the Um <laughs> <laughs> You could be talking about that game and you know wanting to maybe play better down there than RNC has in recent years. Uh, Houston is good. Uh, I know a couple players on there already, and I know they're good. They're athletic, just like us. I think they get up and down just like us. It's going to be a tough game. I'm excited to play down there. And that's all right. Yeah. Marshawn, what are your thoughts? I mean, you guys are, you know, have to play real well down there. Uh, no, nah, every game that i played down there so far has been not so good for me. So just getting a win would be 
would be fine with me. I don't care how, but as long as we win. Anything else? Do you guys enjoy the atmosphere down there? A little, a little change of things? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's really packed out. Yeah. Real packed out. I think the, uh, the more, the better, the bigger the crowd, the bigger we play. That's the way I see it. Yeah, tonight they announced an 8,000, not a bad crowd for a midweek game. Are you guys a little disappointed? Do you think a game like this is going to draw more people out early in the season? I hope so. I, I think if you keep winning, I think the bigger the crowd will be. Great. Thanks, guys. <laughs>